halfway through the fight, man. I really got it looking pretty even to me. Um, it is actually all what I expected it to be. It kind of back and forth, you can see. Porter is definitely coming with some combination. He definitely got some speed and stuff. Um, I see they actually clinch a lot, but I mean, when you're dealing with somebody with power, you know, you really have to make sure you avoid as much as many. You have to avoid as many power punches as possible. Porter is really not backing down. Crawford is going to have to figure out how to get in there and get some opportunities to get some big shots. But like I see, you can see his power. Really an intense fight. Like I say, it's, it's continuous. They're going to go get it. Um, moving around. At certain points in the fight, you can definitely see how... Um, you can definitely see how... Crawford is stalking him, so to speak. You know, kind of cutting the ring down. You know, because Porter is fast. He wants to move around a lot. I like how... Crawford eliminates the ring from him being able to do so. Knockout power from Crawford. Yeah, I mean, you know, it's only it's only so long that Porter was gonna be able to avoid the knockout power from Crawford. And as you can see, Crawford immediately he's on attack mode as he should be, not giving Porter any time to recover. And really. Crawford, you have to just kind of watch this Crawford puts on a display of what he does. And then this knockdown, this K. I really just believe that Porter wasn't going to be able to recover as fast, you know, be able to get up and defend himself. So I want to say it was a good stop, you know, by Porter's father. I definitely don't want to see Sean Porter get hurt. Pretty much the fight was over. Maybe he could have made it, but never know. With your dog, that law. If you come up, don't forget about your dog, that law. I'm a street, so it's the law. If you broke, that should be against the law.